Okay, so, quick disclaimer, possibly. Um, last episode, I wanted to buy the pig farm, or what I thought was the pig farm. Turns out, actually, really is a pig farm. Annoyingly, however, doesn't matter. I am going to show you, whilst we're in the situation. So, um, when I was looking at these, I couldn't get any icons to come up to show me what they were and I forgot that you have to own the farm to be able to see the icons which is annoying because how are you supposed to know which farm you want? Yeah? Seriously. So anyway, this is self-made pigsty. So it is pigs and then we've got a manure heap there, we've got calf pens, igloos there and we have cow shed there. Now, obviously, it would be fantastic to own that, but seeing as how we've made our new plans, and I don't need to do this, um, and we bought the fields and everything else, we're going to make use of some mods, and we're going to put in a a pig a, a homestead pig sty that I found, uh, and we're going to. I've decided we're going to put it in here because this is a pretty small field. I say it's pretty small. Actually, you probably get quite a few bales out of it. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. So we're going to put it in here. Um, just thinking of the other things that we need to do. So we will need to cut those fields because I'm not going to plow that grass in without reaping the rewards of silage. That would just be foolish. So we're going to cut those, we've got that to do, but I think today, to save us or spare us from too much more grass cutting and stuff, <coughs> we will sort out this pig malarkey. Uh, so first things first, we go into construction, we go down, animals, pigs, and then I've got this, homestead pig barn. Now, it looks rickety, and I like that. And I think I'd like it to go here. Somewhere like that. Why does it move? It's very annoying. Yeah, I'm going to go with there. Splendid. So we'll come out of there because we only want one for now. I think this takes ten pigs. Um, I like it. You know, it's all it's got it's all old painted brick and all that. It's got some nice texture to it actually. And then we've got these chipboard wooden panels, nicely spliced together. Must have been a carpenter whoever did that. <laughs> Is this open? It does. That's lovely. So we can come in here. We've got water there. Do we need to give them? We do. We've got the food there. We do. And then obviously they can go in there and do their thing. So. We're going to grab the Lamb Rover. I want to go and get them, as opposed to just buying them and putting them in. The cows will be happy for now. Put my little animal trailer in there. So, a Landy Ahoy. And I'll we'll back you around. So we're just going to go with the ten pigs. No, we're not even going to go with that. We're going to go with five. Because I have the mod installed to give us extra animals at birth. Told you about it before. Can't remember exactly what it's called. Can't remember where we're going. We are going here. Let's 
We don't really need to tag it, do we? Yeah, let's tag it, just in case I get lost. There you go. Oh, I never noticed that bath there before. Somebody's having a tin bath. It's a convention. Who on earth would be walking around here like that? They must have been having some kind of get together. I'm not going to go anywhere near what I was going to say. Why does it not always come off when you drive into them? I don't know. So, looks like we've got a bull in there. He looks like a Shetland. And we want pigs. Porker, sow. Puberty in six months, that's what we want. That's pretty good. So they, um, every four months. Two, three. Oh, we can only have four. Well, that is what we will have. And that is a fair price. Also, £300. And whilst we're here, that's not what I mean, meant to do. I did it again. <laughs> right. I wanted to. Morning. Morning. Bit rude around here, isn't they? Look very Italian as well. I just wanted to come in here and have a look, see what we got. Can we go in through this door? No, but we can have a look through. We've got little calves. Somebody's having a laugh. I must be in their way. Sorry. Sorry, but not sorry. Right, let's get these guys back. Why are they spotted? I don't want spotted, but that'll do. So we're back at our farm. I'm going to pop these piggies into their new home. And they will start growing us some more. I'm not going to get rich off of pigs. Well, don't think we are. We might do. Doubtful. Right, piggies. They're not going to be happy because they're not going to have any water or any food. And they do look. How have we managed to get one black one? What's that all about? Hello. You look happy ish. Okay, so water and food. Uh, I'm not sure. I really want to use the Land Rover for the water tanker. Although, wouldn't be such a bad thing, I guess. Round you go. Just like that. If it hooks on, we'll use it. If it doesn't, then we'll have to bring a tractor around. Ooh. Don't think the Land Rover is going to be happy with this. I'm not overly scared though. <laughs> <laughs> right. Nope. 
try again. There we go. That's costing us money. Rude. Rude, 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 rude. I don't agree with this. I do not agree with it. As you know, farms have wells. That well would go straight in. We'd get our own water from underneath our farm. And we wouldn't be paying for it. I'm guessing that they're going to use a lot more than uh, you would expect them to. Uh, they can't take that much anyway, so that's alright. Um, so we need to give them food. So we're just going <coughs> to... I'm just going to buy a mix. Mixed pig food for now so we'll just grab the X7 I think and take the trailer down oh dear oh dear there's deer everywhere yeah we'll grab the little X7 we'll take the trailer up to the dealers <coughs> Buy us some pig food. So let's stick this back. We've got lots of manure spawning there, which is nice. Getting bigger as we go. Hey, up. I might get us some chicken feed as well whilst we're up there, just to please the little blighters. Oh, I didn't unload. Watch it. I didn't unload the trainer. Oh, uh, no, I don't want that on. I want it off. Backwards driving for the win. Alright, why? That way. Oh, I wish it wouldn't do that. <coughs> Not going to be able to strap these things down on here, am I? Typical. And just like that, we made it in one piece. Right. Um, we need... Uh, bags? Pig food. Uh, we'll have two of those. Yep. Back. It might be cheaper to buy pig food than it actually is to buy. Why is the pig food cheaper than just buying a big bag of wheat? That doesn't make any sense. The pig food is a blend of many things. You'd think that more work went into that. Right, there is. There it is. There's a forklift over there. That sounds like an old Dexter. <laughs> Electric. Gonna no, I'm not. I was gonna go in the song again. I really must remember not to, not to do it. Right. We're gonna have to be extra careful bringing these back.
Seriously? Seriously? That doesn't even make any sense. How does it? Oh, right. Perhaps we need to. What are we on? Reset. Oh, start it then. Let's try that now. No. Oh, it's so confusing. Oh well. I should have to do this the wrong way. Yeah, thanks for the use of your useless blooming thing. So, by the power of What? <laughs> By the power of nothing. How is this even possible? God only knows. Right, well... take this back, we'll uh, think of something else. I decided that the Manitou was the tool of the hour because I remembered that I did actually pick out four bags before. So it's going to be a bit sketchy but we'll get them back there. <laughs> The Magnificent Manitou Strikes Again. I really like this one, actually. <coughs> I um, I do struggle with these cantilever ones. I think they're cantilever, that's what they're called, isn't it? Cantilever. Uh, I have struggled in the past when I've used, used them before. See that? That was like some sort of power genius. <laughs> it even surprised me. <laughs> right. Take the food, piggies. Let's see. Will they take both bags? I'm quite sure they will. Yes, they probably need about three to fill them up. Uh, three? Probably need about six. Three lots of that is what I was meaning to say. Save yourself, Seba. Save yourself. Okay, I shall. Alright, let's go and feed El Chikaroonies. Uh, it's one thing about these is they turn on a dime, don't they? Right, through... Thread the needle. This is, by the way, a really stupid place to put your chickens. And your ducks. And your... Whatever else is in here. What else is in here? Ducks. Can't see. What have we got? I think it's just ducks and chickens, isn't it?
Do 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 do. Go in backwards. Okay, so we're gonna mount the mowers upon. Actually, I'm gonna try something. Hey, yeah, somebody put a post there. It's all right. It wasn't me. If it was me, I'd take it out. Might still do that yet. Be to the, actually, it, it won't be to the disgust of anyone because everybody is editing this map. If you go around and have a look, literally everyone. Literally everyone I've seen playing it has edited this map in Giants Editor one way or another. So I want to see if I can pick up these stones. I'm sure I'm not going to be able to. No. Okay, so we need to take them out of GE. The Giant Editor. And whilst I do, when I do that, I will make some modifications to a lot of other stuff also. Actually, you can stay there for now. I really like that. Okay, so just to run through, we're going to remove these stones because they are annoying me. Um, I'm also going to put a gate, a double gate, in there. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to take out that light, that row of fence, and have a look at a couple of other bits and pieces that I'm not 100% satisfied with something over here I think oh I was gonna yeah I was gonna mess around with that book that um, hedge but we'll go through all that later so we're going to go do some mowing because we really do need to get that silage sold that we haven't even cut yet. I put the drill there because that's a splendid place to put it. And yes, I did just drop it off. That's because it folds down weird, if I remember correctly. I'm gonna put the weight there. And then we'll get the front mower and the rear mower. And we're going to mow these. Whoa! The brakes aren't too good on the McCormick. We're going more mowing, I'm afraid, but needs must. And this is Ireland, and, you know, they love it. They love all this silage. If I was going to do, if I was going to go and do a, a silage season anywhere, I'd go for Ireland for sure. Absolutely. Beautiful scenery. And they really know how to hit it hard. Silage, that is. They know how to hit the beers as well, to be fair. Mostly stouts. <laughs> and whiskies. I like their whiskey, don't they? I don't know. Okay, we're gonna... I'll cut this field and then I'll cut the rest of them off screen. But... It's a big old field. This is gonna get some lovely crop into it. There I go. Start here.
So we're just going to get this little tiny triangle done. And then I'm going to shoot off. I'm going to do the other two. I'll do them off screen. And before the next episode, I think. That's uh, probably the best bet. I may even row it up so all we've got to do is come in and do some bailing. Something like that. And it doesn't become so terribly repetitive with the same old things and we can get on with some other stuff. Splendid. Seabird, splendid. Right, turn that off. All folded up. Nope. Now it's just being silly. Done. Stupid things. Right, uh, so it's that one and that one, if I remember correctly. Have we got a gate going through? Or have we got to go back out on the road? Back out on the road. That's alright. Okay, well, uh, that is that. Terribly exciting that we have some pigs. I've not done pigs since the last Irish map I played on, which was Bally Dawn. I just literally remembered that. That was the last time I did pigs. I'm so terribly unconventional when it comes to Ireland. <laughs> I don't think I don't do things right. <clears throat> I think it's the Guinness goes to my head. Or the Murphy's. Oh. I preferred Murphy's to Guinness. Can I say that? Of course I can say that. I preferred it. Thanks for watching everyone. Stay safe. And may the weather be with you.